about a place. It'll take creation, imagination. Hi everybody, this is Tina. Welcome to my video today, you guys. I am gonna share with you my paper pumpkin kit for this month. I'm a little bit late sharing with you guys, uh, so I wanted to get this video up for you so you could see what the kit looked like this month. It's one of my favorite kits we've ever ever had this is the it's a card kit and then it is a shaker kit so shaker card kit so these um, are all different ways you can make these to do shaker cards I've done a few I've done several different cards I'm gonna show you some of the ones that I did that are shaker cards and then we're gonna put one together that's super simple that is not a shaker card in case you don't want to mess with it okay so here's the first one I did Oh, and look at that. Look what I did, you guys. I wrapped this baker's twine around the whole card. Awesome. Yep, that's, this is what I do, you guys. I'll fix that after I'm done. But this is a shaker card. I trimmed this piece down, and the instructions, when you get your paper pumpkin kit, comes with all the pieces to make the project and instructions on how to do it. You get a stamp set, and you get an ink spot all the time. So I love getting the stamp set and the ink spot, even if I'm not crazy about the project. I love getting the ink pad, the little ink spot, and then the stamp set. So if you want to make these exactly how they're meant to be made you can follow the instructions you guys know I don't do that so I trimmed this down some uh, so that it wasn't so large and then I just stamped right on this now this paper right here is because I tore up my envelopes so you get envelopes in this kit so then you don't even have to worry about it and they're nice they're lined inside but what I did is I used this paper to do more stuff with my kit Okay, so here's the first one. This one, I took these leaves that punched out of this of these pieces right here and I watercolored them. And then I put this sequence over the window part. This one I kept really simple and really flat. So it opens up and then there's nothing in here. It just goes right through to the card. And then there's some sequence on there because you get sequence. And then this was probably my favorite one right here. Has the shaker pieces in the middle here in this circle. And then let's put together a really simple flat one. So right here is the card base. And then we have this piece here. Now it can go like this or it can go like this. The card can open up in this direction or it can open up in this direction. It's totally up to you. So what I wanna do is just put it together sort of how the photo is, but I want it to be flat. I'm not gonna do any shaker pieces. So one of the things in the stamp set is this stamp right here. At first I wasn't sure what it was. It's like this background stamp. And what you do is you stamp on these colorful squares. And then you put some adhesive on here. Now they look like leaves. Super cute, right? So this one is gonna be a really easy one because we're not making it into a shaker card, we're keeping it really flat. This piece right over our card. And then I've done some stamping. There's two other pieces and these pieces just come where you can punch them out. So they're really easy. Like this would be a really great kit to just put together some cards to be able to send out. So then we can just attach this. You could also put this piece on dimensionals, but I just really want this card to be really flat. And that is this card. So there's lots of options. I love, this one's my favorite. I'd love to know which one you guys liked um, or if you will be planning on making some shaker cards with it. And then tomorrow I want you to come back um, and check my video out and my blog post because I made these as well and I'm using these on a card tomorrow. So these came right from the paper pumpkin kits they came from these pieces right here and instead of water coloring these I used embossing powder on them so I would love for you to come back and check out how I did that and that will be tomorrow so thank you guys so much for hanging out with me you can purchase my paper pumpkin it is $20 a month the link is in the YouTube description or you can purchase a prepaid subscription so you can get either one month and try it out 
or you can get three months, six months, a year. Um, so that is super fun. So if you want to do that, those links will be on my coordinating blog post right over here. Um, you can get the prepaid subscription. If you just want to sign up monthly, you can click that in the YouTube description. When you do that, I have an exclusive Facebook group that you guys get to see a whole bunch of ideas for using your kit and you get to be a part of that. And then I send everybody a card every month. So that is a lot of fun. It's a blank card, you get to reuse it. So thank you guys so much for checking this out and I will chat with you guys tomorrow with that special video showing you what I'm using these for. Have a great day guys. Thank you guys so much for checking out my video today and hanging out with me. I have two other videos for you. They're both paper pumpkin related. The first one is the August paper pumpkin kit that I put together and then the second video is the September my paper pumpkin kit. You can check both of those out. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope you're having a wonderful day and I'll be back tomorrow.